Hey everybody, the Bond guest back. Welcome to part 40 of Let's Play Neo. Alright, we're gonna move on to the next main mission, the e Iga Escape, or Iga. I think it, I wish I knew what it is pronounced. Maybe I'll find out in uh, character directory. Okay, it doesn't really say the pronunciation for Iga. So I'm just going to say Iga. And if I'm wrong, you know I'm wrong. I did manage to get like even more prestige points. Including being able to not get hit against Tachibana Munishige. It helps when you're at a high level. So that catapulted me to like 6 prestige points. Not from that alone. I've been getting points for like trying to get more uh, kills with the spear. Anyway, let's put this point in key. Toughness. Ninjutsu power. Key again. Item drop rate. And of course, human close combat damage. It's gonna be a while before we get more points in uh, Agio because of course that's magic based. And you know, killing yokai. Anyway, I think we should be ready to go, I hope. Also, while I was like trying to build up any kills, I didn't get enough points for a level up. I'm gonna change my guardian spirit back to Enko. I was using Itokuri for like, uh, hopefully getting that uh, smithing text from uh, Tachibana. Because it boosts my luck by 50. And no such luck. It sucks, but that's all I can do. Alright, let's move on. Early reports say that many of Mitsunari's men lie in wait up ahead. There will be trouble if they find us. William, I suggest we take an alternate route th through this mansion. You should get us to Saruga sooner. Don't worry, I grew up around here. You won't have any problems crossing through Iga. You know, except for the ninjas that might still try to kill me anyway. Iga province was the domain of ninja clans, until Nobunaga invaded it in 1578 in his campaign to unite all of Japan. The ninja clans resisted fiercely, eventually requiring an infuriated Nobunaga to marshal an enormous army for a final push two years later. The campaign was utterly ruthless. Nobunaga's men slaughtered as many civilians as they did ninja, burning villages, temples, and shrines as they went. Survivors described the experience akin to peering into the depths of hell itself. Alright, seeing as how this is a new region, we're gonna have a lot less elixirs to replenish on our own, aside from what's in our storehouse. So that's gonna be a pain. But I do have a lot of samurai skill points. I should put some points in Spear, for sure. Increase damage of Thrust Attacks. I'm gonna say no to that. It's already... upped. I should get Living Water Heaven. Did I get that for, like, all of them, too? That's probably one of those universal ones. So, it's good to have. Uh, mid stance only spots places of the enemy in front of you to get behind them. Oh, okay, that seems pretty cool too. Get windmill. Let's take a look at it. Oh, that's actually pretty rad. I should get that. So pressing and holding the button cause you to continue to spin. Ah, so you can get even more spins this way. Okay, it has been a while since I actually played this game, so I hope I don't get too rusty. I 
gotta keep uh, my eyes peeled for any surprise ninjas. Oh, I see one right there. Oh, apparently it doesn't happen through this hole. Like when you look through this hole, the ninja's not there. However, if I look through this hole, the ninja is there. Come on, get tired. Okay, I see how it's gonna be. Slam you against the wall! As far as proficiency goes, my sword's already really high, like, as you can see right there. And Spear is the only other one that's actually at six digits. I would imagine, like, a lot of playthroughs of this game, including, like, extra difficulties you unlock later, will definitely contribute to hopefully getting the proficiencies even higher for the other weapons. I almost stepped on a pressure plate there. That would have been bad news. Good thing I saw that at the last second. Ah, oh, I tried to go for my sweep. You done? Yeah, if you get the sweep to work... Okay, for some reason, it didn't really do the finishing blow. Like, if you get it to work by, like, holding block and hit triangle, you'll knock them down. And you'll also be able to get a chance for a finishing blow. Not a lot of revenants over here. Unnatural death. Unnatural death. I mean, to be fair, in Neo is almost every death an unnatural death. I would imagine being slaughtered by ninjas does not count as natural causes. Like that, see? Ow. Eat it. Oh, wow, he's still up. I'll take that. Just try to get some more uh, practice with these revenants. There's an Amrita fiend here, apparently. When it comes to this house, when you think there's a potential for an assault, ten times out of nine, it is. I mean, this is a ninja mansion, after all. This is pretty much their jam. Laying assaults there for ya. Doesn't seem we can go this way. Hi. There, I stabbed you right in the ass. How do you like me now? Well, at least there's more loot over here. Oh! I didn't see you here. Aha! If you take a look on the floor, you'll see some scratches. That is where you will find hidden walls. Game is saying there's also a Kadama nearby. There it is. It's right here. Just wait for him to pop back up. 
And there, there's our first one of the stage. Keeping my eyes peeled for anyone else. So two revenants in this one area. Is it? Is it, are you the reason why this Kusaragama wielding dickhead? So that's a bit of a disappointment. Oh wait, these were cut down by an Amrita fiend. I don't see an Amrita fiend here. Got some frontline armor. It's like the full set. Ah, it's this guy. Hold on, where does this ladder take me? Ah, okay, there we go. That just opened up the shortcut. Doing. I got turned around. Oh, of course. Let me see if I can sneak away from this jerk. He doesn't see me. I don't have to fight him yet. And it looks like he's uh, getting energy from what looks like a giant crystal. Oh, man. The trap door got me. Well, that sucked. Now I gotta climb back up here again. Oh, wait a minute. Was there something else in this room? Like, right here? Oh, another locked door. I guess I will have to fight that fiend. Would have liked to have been able to avoid it. Because I bet you it's going to get healed up. Yeah, you just have to look for the discoloration right there. It was on this spot. Oh. Maybe if I make him go on the trap door. Oh no, he knows. He's aware. Yeah, he's healing up, too. Whoa! Oh, okay. I'll just six, switch to the spear again because I'll get more power per hit. Okay, he's dead. But now I gotta find out where he's channeling all this energy. I also gotta watch my step to make sure I don't fall again. Actually, getting away from that spot. You know what? Let me go back. So I did see what looked like a corpse over there on a rock. It's right over here. And this is like the only opening of the railing. <laughs> Tomonari, whatever that is. Well, it's probably a sword. But is it a good one? Actually, let me look. Newest. Here we go. Has final blow damage, quick attack key reduction. And it's not great. <coughs> I'm 
mean, I'm sure it has some use. That being said, it doesn't really have a lot of what I'm looking for. Alright, now let's make some progress. At least we're back outside again. What is that? It's like that. That's a big ass crystal. Watch it for any. Oh. Come on. Come at me. Okay, fine. Be that way. with that that Yoki was also getting healed up by that crystal are you well you just really drained through like pretty much all my living weapons Good thing I was still able to win. Okay, there's a way outside here. But first, I want to look this way. Just want to see if I would get assaulted by another ninja. Go oh, this way, too. No, I can't. It's actually sealed from that side. So what is this one? What the hell? Is there a door that I missed? Where I'm supposed to go the other way? It's weird that both doors would be sealed. Yeah, they both are. Oh, there's still this one. That's the only one I didn't check. There we go. Oh. It's one way. That's what I gotta deal with now. Secret passage behind that banner. I guess that's where I'm gonna go next. Oh, I see Okadama. I want it. There you go, little buddy. You are now free. What else is around here? Is there a way to get to that shrine so easily? I don't think there is. Can't open from that side. Let me try this one. Side. Just make sure I'm not missing anything. It's very easy to do, all things considered. There's a trap door in this corner for some reason. 
Aha! It's a secret. And look at that. There was a Kadama here, too. Well, who killed this guy? Not about Yoki. Did it get chased all the way here? Well, I'm gonna take these five ninja skill points. Thank you very much. I might have to start using them. What would be good to use it on? What would I like? I do hear there is a particular ninjutsu where if you die, you can get revived. I don't know how true that is, or how accurate that is. But I wonder if it would actually work in some situations. Levitation may not be bad. Helps prevent you from having to deal with those, um... Pressure plates. Increases recurrent damage dealt by 10%. I think that might be something I'd want. Let me hold off on that for now. come back to it later. Okay, now I'm pretty much back to... Pretty close to where I started. Why don't I always get turned around in this room? Even though I'm wearing light armor, I tend to still make a bit of noise when I run. Have you noticed that? I mean, listen. Click, clack, 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 clack. It's gotta be very irritating. Okay, this must be where I need to go. I'd like to get to the shrine. Actually, this is a way back to the first shrine. I mean, I'm not complaining. At least I got that uh, shortcut opened. And there. Okay, now I can level up again. Let's get more points in magic. I want to build that up a little bit more. Can I get more jutsu ready? I don't think I can. You know, rejuvenation talismans would be really dope. Because then I won't have to worry about healing so much. I don't exactly have a lot of uh, jutsu ready as is. All right, let me unready this. The fire one. And then I'll replace it with maybe... Keep life seal. And maybe I'll go with rejuvenation? Yeah, I like rejuvenation. Anything that can gradually heal me without needing to use an elixir? It's dope to me. Oh, no, I don't want to change my guardian spirits. Let me look at my Kadama blessings. Let's go with Amrita increase for now. Alright, let's stop here. And in the next part, we'll continue on through this uh, castle. See you, everyone. Thanks for watching.